Before starting the video, I would like to ask you a favor. Please do like, share and subscribe the channel. Let's start today's video. Love. The intoxicating potion that has launched a thousand ships, written a million sonnets, and inspired countless romantic comedies. It's the stuff of dreams, right? Well, sure but it can also be the stuff of nightmares if you find yourself caught in the love trap. Don't worry, though, I'm here to guide you through the maze of emotions, heartaches, and cheesy pickup lines to help you stay out of that sticky situation. Chapter 1, The Love Mirage Picture this, you're strolling through the park, the sun is setting, and there, on a park bench, you see them, the object of your affection. They look like a vision in soft focus, bathed in golden light. But hold on a second. That's not love, it's your brain playing tricks on you. It's called the love mirage, where your hormones are partying hard, and your judgment is taking a coffee break. Remember, real love is about depth, not just looks. Chapter 2, The Romeo and Juliet Syndrome Ah, the classic tale of star-crossed lovers, Romeo and Juliet. A story of passion, tragedy, and really bad decision-making. Don't be a Romeo or Juliet, folks. Love isn't about sacrificing your happiness, your identity, or your life for someone else. It's about finding someone who complements you, not completes you. Chapter 3, Love and Compatibility you know those people who claim they're in love after the first date? Yeah, don't be one of them. Love isn't something that magically happens overnight. It's about compatibility, shared values, and growing together. So, before you start planning your wedding on the first date, take a step back and get to know the person. Chapter 4, The Texting Tango In the modern world, Love often begins with a text. But beware, the texting tango can be treacherous. You send a message, they take hours to reply, you overthink it, and suddenly you're in a spiral of anxiety. Remember, texting isn't a measure of someone's interest. They might be busy, not glued to their phone, or maybe they just like to savor the conversation. Chapter 5 love versus infatuation love is patient kind and enduring infatuation is obsessive impulsive and short-lived it's crucial to distinguish between the two love is like a fine wine it gets better with time infatuation is like fast food it's instantly gratifying but not sustainable choose wisely Chapter 6, Trust Your Gut Your gut feeling is like a built-in love detector. If something feels off or fishy about a person, listen to it. Your intuition can save you from a lot of heartache. Don't ignore those red flags waving like a bullfighter's cape, they're trying to protect your heart. Chapter 7, The Power of Self-Love Before you can truly love someone else, you must love yourself. It's not just a cliché, it's a universal truth. When you're secure in your self-worth and content with who you are, you're less likely to fall into the love trap, seeking validation from others. Chapter 8, Communication is Key A healthy relationship is built on open, honest communication. If you're feeling unsure or have concerns, talk it out. Bottling up emotions or making assumptions can lead to misunderstandings and unnecessary drama. Chapter 9, Keep Your Independence Being in love doesn't mean losing yourself. Maintain your own interests, hobbies, and friendships. A healthy relationship is a partnership, not a merger. Chapter 10, Embrace the Journey Love is a roller coaster ride, with its ups and downs. There will be moments of exhilaration and moments when you want to throw up, metaphorically, of course. 
Embrace the journey, learn from your experiences, and don't be afraid to take a break from the love scene if you need to. In conclusion, staying away from the love trap is all about balance, self-awareness, and a healthy dose of humor. Love is a beautiful and complex adventure, but it shouldn't be a trap that holds you captive. So, go forth, navigate the world of love with wisdom, and remember, you're the hero of your own story, not a character in a rom-com script.